And Black Friday, Cyber Monday, huge shopping days for consumers, but now Package Theft Wednesday. Yeah. Who wants this to be a what holiday? A buzzkill, right? No kidding. But with so many people, of course, now ordering their holiday gifts online, thieves stealing packages right off your porch, becoming a growing problem. Carlos Diaz tackling it all. He's live from the mailing station there on the northeast side of the city uh, with tips on how to prevent this, uh, Carlos, because this is just a really growing trend, as we mentioned. Yeah, Ben, it's such a growing trend. They actually have a name for them, Porch Pirates. They come to your house. They steal your packages right off your front porch. This is becoming an epidemic. People that I talked to when I said I'm going to be doing this story, they said, we, we have to talk about this because there are so many people that are affected by this. So we have Scott Motter, who is here. You've, been, you've owned this uh, mailing station for 17 years, so he's a packaging authority. Uh, so what's the number one way that you can prevent packages being sold on your front porch. Well, what I recommend is that uh, when you are ordering a package or ordering an item for yourself, uh, request a signature. That way it's not necessarily left at your front door. You'll have to be there to sign for it, and therefore that's going to prevent that package from being stolen. Yeah, that's, that's the number one thing, because I, I, and I know it could be a pain in the butt to have to, you know, if they, if they take it back, you have to go to UPS, and sometimes it's in transit, but it's there for safety. Mm -hmm. Now, mm -hmm. uh, uh, another great point is if you have a mailbox, like one of these mailboxes here, at the mailing station, you can actually have your packages delivered here for free, correct? Correct. Yeah, that's part of the service that we offer uh, along with the, uh, we're going to sign for that package for you and then it's also out of the elements. So that's another thing that sometimes people are, are, are a little worried about is that when it rains, it snows. If that package is not under a covered porch, it's going to be here safe and dry. And then, of course, Amazon being so popular these days, there's a new feature called Amazon Dropbox and our Bruce Cop did a feature on this for the 11 o'clock news last night and he talked to people about being able to go to a location and pick up their packages in that Amazon Dropbox. Take a listen. That's a good idea for them to be able to come and like pick it up without nobody stealing their stuff because the world is, you know how the world's going on now. That's easier, safer, and you won't have to worry about your stuff coming up missing. And then the third thing that we can talk about this, uh, this hour is uh, if you have a home security system, like I have cameras all over my, my house, you should let the potential thieves know right, right. that you have that home security system. Absolutely, absolutely. Having a camera uh, right on your uh, peephole or having one up in an inconspicuous corner, you know, uh, doesn't necessarily have to be able to see the camera, but letting them know that you have a camera. Right, exactly. Know. I mean, or having that in the front yard that says, you know, ADT or Vivint or whatever right. home security you have. Let the potential thieves know that they are being filmed, uh, you know, so that they maybe de will deter them from uh, taking your packages. We've got so many po more points to, to, to talk about. Uh, coming up next hour, we'll talk about more ways to prevent packages from being stolen and a bonus shipping tip, Ben and Julia, a bonus <laughs> shipping tip that you do not want to miss. Shipping tip there, Ben. And Ben, you had a great suggestion. You had a, a, an observation, too, what, what people are doing when they're following these trucks. Yeah, I mean, we've seen several stories before where these thieves will actually just follow those FedEx or UPS trucks when they're doing drop-offs. And, you know, that sometimes is a thankless task, those drivers. They're just trying to get those packages dropped off as quickly as possible. They can't possibly track who's uh, following them. So just be aware. I know uh, we're looking forward to those tips uh, on the way, uh, Carlos. Thank you so much. But mm -hmm. this is a big deal because everybody's, you know, ordering online now. Uh, it's so much more convenient. But, yeah. you know, if you end up getting yeah. porch pirated, yeah. I oh guess God. maybe and not. I think that's awful. And yeah. the best thing that you can have in your neighborhood is what they used to call a nosy neighbor. <laughs> That's but, true. But, yeah. but I call engaged friend mm -hmm. who will let you know. <laughs> right. I mean, right. I, 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 you know, I'm very thankful for people like that yeah. in my yeah. life. We've got them in our neighborhood too. So 